That's right. We are going racing tonight. We are going racing. Is our sound working? Yeah. Sound is functional. Beautiful. So we're gonna go uh, do a going live message. Oh, yikes. S LPR Praga League season finale at Sonoma. S beautiful racetrack that is. Dif very difficult track. Very difficult to drive there. I'm going to send my going live linkies, linkies? links uh, all over the place. Mm, yeah, and yeah, we're just going to go ahead and join the server. A few people, we are not going to be listening to music today just because I need practice. I need like to my practice to be as, eff as effective as possible. I got some donuts here. I'm gonna eat a donut right now. Mmm! Good donut! Oh yeah, I like that. Oh, that's a good donut. Oh yeah, fantastic. I'm, I'm eating way too much sugar today, by the way, but that's okay. Mmm! Mm. Delicious. That's a good donut. Not too greasy, not, you know, not, not, you know, not old enough to be, like, not too, not too greasy, not too stiff. Just, okay. So, we are not going to be doing any, like, we, are, we, we I've done my qualifier runs, and, like, I, I'm just going to do my race runs now. Because that's, that's just more important. This uh, race, I believe, will be very much about, attr the attrition rate will be very high race will be very much about staying alive okay let one through I do need to bring my brake I keep forgetting to bring my brake bias to 57 in the setup Yeah, lots of people are gonna be joining us, so this will be a busy practice session, which is great, actually. It will allow me to, you know, practice driving with other people on track, if not directly race them. Okay, yeah, that's all right. That's all right. We got one and a half hour until the race, which so I'm I'm I'm, I'm starting practice a bit early tonight because I need it. I really need all the practice I can get. That was quite slow, but not stupidly slow. Mm. That's fine. Hey, hello there, Dima. Oh, yeah. Ah, fuck, I've forgotten to upshift. Good and tug. Nalieva, nalieva. Oh, that's a bad, that's bad. That's so slow. At least I kept it on track. Oh, that's, that's nice, nice, nice. Chuck <sighs> Okay, I can turn to left. Nalieva, отлично. 
Okay, then. Oh, that's good, that's good. That's a purple mini sector. I mean, that doesn't. Purple mini sectors don't really matter. But it's funny when I get them. I keep I I that's I get I I got that wrong second time. And how does that like is it because uh the tires are dirty? Hmm. Just instant lock. Hmm. That's a good donut. Hmm. Excellent. Skill issue. Okay, it's fine. This is why I'm starting practice early, so I can you know get all my skill issues out of the way nice and early and not have them later in the race. Because that's how it works, right? I got a set amount of skill issues that I have to have in a day. Okay, don't go all the way to the right, don't go all the way to the left. Very nice. Oh, much better. Yeah, much better. Let's go. Okay, can we maybe not lock the brakes this time? Yeah, just like this. Very nice. Okay, let's go. Doing quite well now. I mean, I say that, but I still haven't set a representative lap time. Whoa. Oh, I don't know. The car's a bit m more unpredictable than it has been than it was yesterday, it feels like. I'm not sure why it would be. I think I've just forgotten how to drive it overnight. It's fine. I'll remember. Okay, no, that's all right. That's all right. That's all right. Oh, that's yeah. Uh, yep. We're in the green. Still need to set a clean lap time. My back's gonna hurt so much, by the way. Like, it's already hurting quite a bit. Okay, tires are a bit dirty, so that will affect braking. Mm, not too badly, though. Yeah, this is okay. Not a good lap time, but a lap time. Oh, maybe not. Guess I, guess I did go off track there. I keep going on the bloody curb because I'm stupid. Don't touch the curb button, simply don't.
Ah, fuck. I just spilled a bit of tea on myself. Not too much and it's not too hot, so... Not too bad. Just annoying because... This shirt was clean this morning, you know? And now it's, and now it's got tea on it. A bit silly of me. Finally. Ah, and immediately I fucked it. Like, honestly. We're gonna have so many red flags, yo. Like, there's no way. There's no way we aren't. Because, like, even if people try to be careful, some people are just... Like, the pace difference is also so much that... I'm actually gonna try practicing alternate lines a bit later. Just because... I, I want to be. I don't want to be end up following f behind somebody who breaks a full 50 meters earlier than I do. That's a good way to to hit them. You know. Behind. At least the admins haven't been complaining too, mu too much about driving standards since that time after PGO, I think. Or after, or was it after Istanbul? I don't remember. I got really annoyed about that. But yeah, if, but if I see them complain about it again, I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna be very mad. Because the track selection in this league has been very, very, very carnage friendly. You've got, you know, you've got terrifying T1s, murder cubs, and just straight up difficult tracks like this one. On tracks like this, the only way to keep it clean is a. Uh, is to use some sort of a rating system and gate the event to only high rated people. High safety rated even, not... You know? But that would cut down the grid sizes massively and... People like having their large grips in a... Grids? Grids? Grids. In a set of course league racing. But like, you know, with having it, with having it being an open league where anyone who can get in the Discord and join. You're not, like, it's, it's like a certain drive, there's simply... Uh, you have to be realistic with your expectation, is what I'm saying, when you run a league with... The, no requirements to enter. It's 
especially once your league starts getting popular and you know LPR is pretty popular right now and, and with popularity comes more larger grids more people but with more people comes people who are worse at driving naturally you know also people who are better it's just that you know the more people you're gonna have the larger spread the largest spread between the best and worst drivers is going to be. Hold on, I'm getting a call. I'm gonna take that. Or maybe not, I don't know. All right, I've been invited over for pancakes tomorrow, which is cool. All right, let's go. I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat the second donut. Oh yeah, look at this thing; it's beautiful. Mm. Mm. Good donut. Really good. This donut has got little bits of marshmallow on top, which is fantastic. Mm. And okay, made it around this happen. I do think I should upshift to 6 then I'm just a bit scared. Oh, that's a good exit though. I think that was about the right line actually. Oh yeah, that's much better. Okay, let's go. I can get a really good exit out of this to recover some of the time I just lost. Not all of it, but some. Yeah, like that. At least we're still in the green for the whole lap. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I was. That's faster. Oh yeah, that's better, that's better. So, the yeah, 6th gear, definitely useful. 
does get me a few kilometers above t above 212. It's, it's, a, it's just a few, but over a race distance that's gonna make a difference. That's better. Yeah, I know I have an easy time save coming up into this in this long left hander. Yeah, that's yeah, that's gonna be faster. Yeah, yeah, look at that. Easy, easy, almost two tenths. Come on, man. Skillation. Oh, this. Oh, yeah. That's a good tea. Oh, yeah. Mm, that's not the fastest way to do it, but it's a way. Fair, these guns are also very much about just surviving them because a lot of people straight up aren't going to like i'm not surprised i wouldn't be surprised if you know there's people who spin out there like every two laps not because i think there's really bad people in this league but because these are just super difficult turns Bad line, bad line, big time loss. This bit is gonna be really tricky to follow through though. Really tricky. Like the dirty air. The unpredictability of the line. Like the other person might just get, you know, a bad run and get terrible lines as a result. And you have to deal with that if you're behind. Um, the best bet to, in there is to just, you know, try to stick close enough. And then make an overtake into the following hairpin. It's just that, you know, keeping it close enough is going to be quite difficult. But there's going to be a lot of backing off in the race just for safety's sake. A lot. I mean a lot. Oh, yeah. Gaming.
Oh, I hit the wall. I touched the wall. No, I touched the wall. Why do I touch the wall? Okay, mistake. Okay, not recovery, not good, but okay. That would like allow one car through, but it keeps me on track and that's what matters. My right, my right foot hurts already shit. Come on! That should have been allowed. By the rules of the league, that's, that was on track. I'm pretty sure. Eh, it's not like I lost a good lap. Eh, it's not like that, that kind of thing is gonna be really noticed in the race. Since we haven't got real penalty now. I wonder why we haven't got real penalty anymore. Guess it's been causing some sort of issue because, I mean, has to, it has to have been causing issues because why else would it get removed, right? Hmm. Could have been better. Recovered a bit sooner if I hadn't, uh, if I just, you know, went into full recovery mode instead of keeping, instead of trying to also keep some speed. I keep, I, I've, you know, I still, I still haven't remembered to set my brake balance properly in the setup. So, oh yeah, I feel like I would have locked. If my brake balance had been 58. And left. And turn left some more. Shouldn't have braked. Got a bit scared. Bit wide. That's nice.
You can go the Danny. Danny is absolutely zooming around this track. I don't know, but he, he, I guess he, like he really wants a T-shirt. Well, I know I ain't getting one. Best I can do is if I somehow get a P2 and P3 is catch up to for BN, but that ain't gonna happen because I mean this is not right. Like I can see one podium happening due to attrition and you know some collisions between the fast guys, but two, nah. I'm just too darn slow and too darn inconsistent. Yeah, but you know, see, took the safe lines instead of the fun. Too often you have to choose between safety and speed around here. Makes me uncomfortable. Makes me worried about the race. But everything about this truck and the car makes me worried about the race. It's just gonna be, there's gonna be blood. I ain't no way around it. There's gonna be lots of blood. series was at least open setup I, I could I could at least ensure my own survival but I can't so no how I mentioned how I really dislike fixed setups after this it's just a, I get the idea and I think it probably has kept the, clo the field I mean has it really kept the field field closer because we still got people like who are five seconds of the leader space right now? We got, you know, we got Liam Carr over there, five seconds of pace from Maraver. You can see it on the left. That's you know, that's about the pace difference I would normally see with open leagues, even with open setup leagues. So I don't know if it's worked. I'm not. I'm, I'm really not sure if it's worked. It just ends up favoring the people who happen to to be good at, the, at driving that particular setup that's chosen, rather than people who are good at making a setup that works for the car and for them. And you know, it just like I don't know, but like I say, it's just, it's like it, I don't think it like. I can't even say that it takes out the skill because it emphasizes a different skill than setup than open setup leagues. And I just right, I and I'm just I just don't think it does. To I'm actually not sure that it actually you know keeps the field closer. I pr may, pro, most likely it does uh, keep the separation between the top top like the regular fast guys and the fastest guys. They, they do keep that separation small but slow guys are gonna be slow no matter what setup you put them on yeah I, I, su I suppose that's the case me I just end up in the midfield whatever I do At least on pace, on consistency, I usually end up a bit lower than that. <laughs> but yeah. But yeah, what did... What <laughs> yeah, but like... It's, it's like what what, 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 a, what a fixed setup does is it, it... It favors the driver whose natural driving style happens to fit the setup chosen. And... More importantly, and I can't because well, probably probably that because the, I think more importantly because I think that's the intent of fixed setups. It it emphasizes the skill of the skill of adapt or adaptabi ad adaptability. 
the ability of the driver to adapt the driving style to the current setup given to them. My adaptability is not very good, so... So fixed setup leaks do not favor me. So I suppose I, it, it does kind of look, just look, look back around to me. But honestly, like, my pace different again, my pa It's not even that, because my pace deficit is... About the same as what I would expect of myself with open setups. Mm. May, some, some tracks a bit more, some tracks a bit, a bit less, def depending on how I like... How, how I feel the setup matches the track. Because that's another thing, right? The setup's got to match the track, and... With a fixed setup, you're always gonna... Unless you run, you know, the same exact track, or, very, or just several very similar tracks... You, you're almost never going to have a setup that matches the track. And that's, I think, that's the, the thing that really kills fixed setup racing for me. When you end up feeling that the car just shouldn't be there, just shouldn't be on this track, because it's... It just, not, it just feels like nothing works, and it's... It's just plain unpleasant. I think, and I think this track is, like, I like this track a lot. It's very flowing, it's got, it's got some overtaking opportunities, it's got some tricky braking zones, but not too many. You know... <sighs> yeah, it's insane bits are balanced out by relatively normal ones in a very good way. And that's a skill issue. Ooh, yeah, that jump, holy shit. But, but the setup and the car, they just... They, this setup just doesn't belong here. The car just... It, the car just doesn't want to do anything. None of the things that this track requires, the car wants to do. Hey, Tangelizer. How are you doing? Done any good Tangelizing recently? Come on. Okay, last lap on this fuel. Last lap on the fuel. On this fuel. And... Yeah, did you... Oh, oh, oh did, you, did you come in just in time to see me launch off that curb? That's a killer curb, that is. We're gonna see, we're gonna see some, uh, we're gonna see some flips. Oh, why did you stop there, Jacob? Oh, skill issue for real, skill issue. Okay, I'm gonna see what Iker will do to overtake me. I'm not even defending, I'm just trying to take the corner. Okay, and yeah, he'll just pull up alongside and n not overtake because he wants to stay behind for whatever reason. Okay. Okay, I'll let him. I'll let Come on, go, 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 man. Let me see how following him works out around. Very used tires, but very low fuel, so... Oh, that's an unsafe rejoin and a half. Oh, you hear that? I hear my neck just creaking. Okay, and then to the pits I go. Back to pits. Discord. Let me check Discord. My neck hurts so much right now. Holy shit. I'm gonna be in so much pain after this, y'all. Oh, you know what? I've forgotten to get my fan. Okay, hold up. I'm not gonna get that fan because it's too, too annoying.
I'm gonna get this one. Okay, so you're gonna have to tell me if this fan affects the microphone too much when I turn it on. Uh, sorry, I uh, should be back now. Can you hear me? Yes. Is the game like is the game come to work? I think it is. Oh, maybe not. Okay, can you hear the game right now? Yeah, it's gonna be. Yeah, not yet. Uh, in one, in just under one hour, Mortis, we're gonna be uh, racing. For now, it's time to practice. But it's gonna be time to race soon. Oh no, 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 whatever. You cannot hear the game at all, can you? Shit. Yeah, the, why is the game not capturing anymore? <clears throat> uh, that's so annoying. I. Uh, Uh, I, I, I'm just gonna do this actually. Yeah, I'm just gonna enable desktop capture for now because I'm not gonna have any music on today, so it'll be fine. Yeah, that's that's a quicker fix. Okay, we don't have uh, 20 minutes left on the, before the server resets again. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a quick, uh, you know, quality type run. Got, gotta practice my quality pace as well a bit, you know. Yeah, we're gonna exit just behind leader Danny Tutui. So maybe we can. No, we're gonna we're gonna be too far behind to follow his lines. But we should be. Yeah, we, we should be in some free air, which is important. Just nobody to interrupt our practice program. Yeah, I gotta trust the car a bit over that over that crest, but I just can't. The the car, you know, is not trustworthy, not really. Yeah, this cube, that cube is insane, by the way. It, oh, so is this one. Like, they can launch you into straight into space. Hit them hard enough and you just go flying. Zooming everywhere but where you're supposed to go. Bit wide, but that's all right. Okay, we're good, we're good. Are we good? Yeah, we're good. Fantastic, let's go.
how do we keep how do we turn left yeah okay good 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 I'm just trying to my, my headphones going. Okay, hold up. I need to get that cable in a better place because it keeps going. Cutting out. Cutting out. Okay, this is better but still bad. Okay, this. Okay. This is good. If it stays that way, that'll be nice. Come on. Okay, that should be better, I think. At least the microphone's still on. Oh, I said of course the sound works now. That's amazing. Come on. I've, okay, uh, hold on. I'm, I'm gonna solve... I think I know what's causing that issue, so I'm gonna solve it. This, like this. Okay, yeah. That should be better now, I think. It's really annoying because, like, when the fan is on, I'm cold, but the f when the fan is off, I'm overheating a bit. So, I, I think I'm gonna keep it on for the race, but for now, I will see how it goes for now. For now, I'll keep toggling on it because I don't need it, you know, to be. Yeah, because for the race, I'll be, I'll be sweating f more for sure. So, I'll need the fan, most definitely. Okay, uh, I'm just ahead of Arno, hopefully I will not annoy him too much by being here. That's wide. That's quite wide. Much better. Oh, 
course start accelerating a bit earlier I think but didn't lose too much time not too bad not too good either Okay, use all the wheat available. And that would be an improvement of over what over a tenth. At least I'm within two seconds of the leader right now. I'm actually like in a bit of a no man's land right now. Like people are behind, are quite a ways behind and people are ahead uh, out of my reach. Uh, if I will be completely okay if it ends up like that in the race to be honest it will give me a nice safe decent result to take, to take home some good points in my pursuit of of top 10 in the championship which uh, I am in the top 10 I'm number 10 but uh, I just need to make sure I keep that so which means I just need to make sure I get a better essentially I just need to make sure I get a better result than three Kunas. Or if I do get a worse result, it, like I can only lose I think like three, four points to him. So yeah. So yeah, primary goal is to outrace uh, Tautvida Svinkunas. That's my plan A. Right, break and break number two and break again and just keep going, keep going. Uh, yikes, lost, uh, lo lost some, a couple, tenth. See, not to. So good qualifying isn't gonna be too. Like it's gonna be. It's not gonna be too important here just because of the high rates of attrition I'm expecting. A couple of people ahead are going to crash. Yeah, you know, yeah, like you know, people. All right, the other people everywhere are going to crash, and everywhere inclu includes ahead of me. Unfortunately, it also tends to include me, so I have to be. So my real goal is to simply not crash, and that should secure me a decent enough result. Oh, come on! Like, it's just not quite wide enough, right? It's just not quite as wide as I think it is it, oh, every time, so I have to a bit back out of it. I need to figure out when the hell I can even start properly accelerating. Because that, I think that's what's really killing me there. I just go full throttle a bit too soon and have to back out because of that. Oh! Yeah, this is what I'm talking with about trusting the car. You just, you just, you just put your pedal to the metal and and hope that it works out. Hey, Satan! Uh, uh, uh. Uh, very scary. Oh, come on! Oh, I kept it on track. Kept it pointing the right way too. That's actually that's actually really good for the race. That's actually amazing for the race. It's a very difficult track. This is, but I think I complained to you about that yesterday. 
It's it's gonna be carnage. It's gonna be carnage on race day. Race day. It is race day. It's gonna be carnage in. Oh, actually, I'm, it's about time for me to go and grab my energy drink. Haha. -ha. Oh yeah. So we're gonna. Okay, no, I'm gonna let. I'm. Oh shit. Oh yeah, that's. Uh, and that's the problem with those curbs. Do you see that launch? Fucking hell, man. <laughs> Yeah, those cubs are, pro are a problem. Like, they just launch you in such a way that you cannot remain even remotely in control of your car, because... Well, because the wheels aren't in contact with the ground, and if your wheels aren't in contact, you can't control the car. You know, it ain't, it ain't a hover car, it's not a plane, even though it's got wings. But, it, but it's got to, it's, it has got to have contact with the ground to be controllable. Believe it or not. So, like, you know, when you, fl when you go flying, you're done. Even Jesus himself taking the wheel will not save you at that point just because the wheel doesn't do shit. Oh, my brake bias is wrong. Kek <laughs> W, my comrades. Kek W. Okay, I'm gonna. Okay. We're gonna. I'm gonna go get that energy drink out, out of the freezer. Freezer? Fridge. I don't put my energy drinks in the freezer. Not usually. This is a significantly worse donut than the, than the ones I've had before. Anno Arinka Sassetto Corsa. I mean, Sassetto Corsa is just Italian, right? It's just Italian words. Anno Arinka I mean, Anno is a word, but it's only by coincidence. I didn't know it was a word when I came up, came up with the username. <laughs> Triple AC. I am the link. How you doing, man? Uh, this is not a very good donut at all. I regret buying it. It's so crumbly. In a way that I don't like. Very, very dry. It's a very dry donut. Oh. I mean, you know this. <laughs> I, I mean, it could be. I could legally change my name. That's the thing people do. And like, what does a real name even mean? Right? Is a name real just because it's your legal name? Right? Because the only difference with that and whatever name you've made up for your username is... Uh, the only difference is when it, it, it was made up. You know? I don't know. He does give me Bob vibes. Not a lot of them, but some. I wanna find. I wanna check something. Do I have a quote system? I wanna check if I have a quote system active. Okay, uh, I do have a quote system from Three Elements now. <laughs> so, uh. I do. I don't remember like who is allowed to do to make quotes. I don't remember who is a. Can you can like I, I don't know go wild go, go wild with the quotes unless the permissions are set up wrong. In, in which case you cannot go wild. Go wild if it's legal for you to do so. That's. I th okay, so I'm gonna restart the game now, real quick, actually, and because I, I'm I'm gonna download the updated skin pack, so we can see everybody's beautiful liveries. We got some good ones in this. We we do have a disappointingly high amount of red and black liveries, which I'm a big hater of red and black liveries. I think it's just the most overused color combo in all of racing and sim racing. 
and like all it ends up looking like is Shadow the Hedgehog. You ended up on some random shit. Oh no. How did that happen? You're back now. What was I saying? Yeah, I was complaining about red and black race car liveries, which I consider very ugly and stupidly overused. Because, you know, that shit just looks like... That shit just looks like Shadow the Hedgehog. That, that's all it looks like. <clears throat> and, and everybody knows Sonic is faster, so your race car should be blue. That's how it works. Uh, yeah. Yeah. And you also shouldn't make your race car red, because then it looks like a Ferrari, which means you'll have Ferrari strategy and you'll have Ferrari engines and Ferrari reliability. That, that's how that works. Although Ferrari has been better about that recently, in F1 that is. And you know, they, were, they have been okay from the start when they returned to, to Endurance Championship, to WEC, with their hypercar. I mean, they did win Le Mans last year. So, yeah, pretty rapid in uh, in endurance. Hello, Moni, how you doing? Is the server, like, I'm just waiting for the server to reset, but it's taking out its time, so... So, we just... Okay, I, I'm gonna... I, I, got a, I got a proper engineering. I got I got myself a monster for this one. It's the season final, fi finale, right? I, I can... I, I'm allowed to have a nice en energy drink for the season finale. It tastes weird. It doesn't taste like I remember white monster tasting. It's a more it's more citrusy. There is more of a flavor. There's more of a flavor than usually because is white monster like different in Russia? I mean, I wouldn't be surprised. I'm somewhat disappointed because I really like that white monster and this is Yeah, it's a, it's it's too citrus. It's too citrusy. It's a very slight citrus flavor, but it's there, and like it shouldn't be like even a slight flavor. It should be a hint, a hint of a flavor, right? Just the idea of citrus has to be infused into the drink, but none of the citrus itself, merely the idea of it. That's uh, no, that's how white monsters taste in Russia. The caption software, by the way, cannot parse, absolutely cannot parse white monsters. Oh, this time it did. This time it worked. Well, it's not consistent with that. That's it. It's interesting that, you know, it does recognize some things like brand names and, you know, just names and capitalizes them. Like when I said World and Union's Championship. Uh, this one, this time didn't work. The World Endurance Championship. Yeah, see, this time it capitali capitalized it like it's supposed to be. WEC. It doesn't know, it doesn't know what WEC means. WEC. WEC. Yeah, I'm just messing with the captions now. Uh, not like they're difficult to mess with. But yeah, I'm actually there's actually an endurance race going in right now, though not in not in the work in IMSA in the American Endurance League. They're doing the 12 hours of Sebring this weekend, and the race is going on right now. And you can watch it on YouTube. Like there is an official stream on YouTube by IMSA. Which is very cool of them to do. I, I, I watched it for a couple hours before the start of the stream. L last time I checked, the purple LMP2 car was leading the LMP2 class. The golden Cadillac was leading the hypercars. Well, hypercars, they're called GTPs in IMSA, but most of those cars are 
the same as hypercars in, uh, in, in, in European endurance. They're not exactly the same class, but they're close enough that a lot of the cars are the same. Like, the Porsche is the same, the Cadillac is the same in both. Mm. Honda, Honda only does... Uh, well, yeah, Honda only does the American series, the Acura. Under their, yeah, the Acura brand. Acura or Acura, actually. I have no idea. Like, like that's only an American thing, so... I don't... I... You know, like for many years, my only, my one and only exposure to Acura or Ac Acura, I think it's Acura. Tell me, tell me if you know. But yeah, my only exposure to a brand was Need for Speed on the Ground, and I thought that was just some weird, ah, fucking, hell. some weird high performance car thing, you know, that would be in a racing game. And then I realized that no, it's it's just Honda. Literally, it's literally just Honda, like, and all the cars that are Acuras in the US, you know, they, you know, they all exist here, they're just called Hondas. It's actually really interesting just how many cars are exactly how many times they're exactly the same car like not even with ch not even visually changed right because you know cars being built on the same platform and only changed you know aesthetically and sold as different models it does do also happens all the time but often it's not even that like uh like Dacia, like like Dacia Logan and like Dacia, like Dacia as a brand doesn't exist everywhere. Everything that's Dacia or, da or Dacia, I think I think Dacia is the correct way to say it, but it's spelled Dacia. But yeah, like in Russia, that brand doesn't exist. All the Dacias in Russia are Renaults because Renault owns them and they just, they just use it as their more budget brand. Oh, another thing I noticed uh, is uh, there's two cars called there's the Chevrolet Spark and there's the Deo Matisse. Now these those two are pretty much the same car. Like I think, but something that I didn't know existed is a is a is a Chevrolet Matisse. I I only saw those after coming to Spain and I'm like, wait, what the fuck? I thought these were either Chevrolet Matisse. Uh, sorry, I, I'm, I, th I thought those were either Chevrolet Spark or Deo Matisse. Those are the same car, but I thought that only those name combinations of name existed, of, of brand and model name. But ap apparently no. Apparently around here there's Chevrolet Matisse, which is wild to me. For years I thought it, there was two options. Yeah, there's lots of stuff like that. You know, cars that represent the brand in name only, really being built by somebody completely different, like, well, like my mother's car, the Chevrolet Niva, which is not a Chevrolet, it's a Vaz, it's a Lada, it's just called a Chevrolet because for a while GM owned part of Lada. Wait, Chevrolet isn't GM, is it? I'm, or am I being stupid? Yeah, Chevrolet is GM. Yeah, it is. I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it is. Because there's Ford, there's GM, and there's like one more. Or am I stupid? Am I stupid, y'all? No, don't answer that. Do answer that, I want to know what you think. Ah, I, I, okay, I don't answer that. I know the answer. I'm fucking stupid. I hit. I touch the curb, even though I know it kills you. Why would I touch it when I know it kills me? Honestly. Okay. But yeah.
But anyway, yeah. What I was saying is that. G For a while, several years, oh, gee, am I not, I'm, I'm being really, I, I, like, I, I cannot remember that, that shit right now. I'm too busy driving. You know, they owned part, part of Lada at, 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 for a while. So, so yeah, some of those were literally the same cars. The Chevy Niva is a decent enough car, though. Like, Forest Prices are really capable of fraud. No, it's it's you know it's a lot nicer than if you just bought an old UAZ. UAZ, I guess. I don't know. However, you however you say your Z's or Z's, doesn't matter because because really it's a was. Say that, but that, but that's okay. Still, still faster than last time. Skill issue, major skill issue. Anno, what are you doing? You silly bastard! Absolute silliness happening here. Now, when the race starts, we, I will. Ask, what I will do is I will uh, give you all a shout out to the commentated broadcast, which I do recommend you check out. Uh, Mateusz is a pretty damn good commentator. Unfortunately, he's not joined by Dave today. Yeah, you know, the, you know, but they commentate together. It gets, it works really well actually. And <clears throat> fuck it, they, they, they can bring the hype like no other. I was trying to get Fish to commentate on a race actually. He didn't agree, obviously. Men's allergic to playing anything that's not Minion Masters. Or League, fucking hell. Like, can you have a worse, a worse tasting game than Minion Masters and League of Legends? I don't think it gets a lot worse than that. Than that specific combination.
Yeah, that's not too bad at all. Oh yeah, let's go. Oh yeah! We zoom in boys! We zoom in boys and girls! So this is practice, but the race starts... So the actual race session starts in 10 minutes. So this is like the last bit of qualifying I get to do before the race. Did I say the last bit of qualifying? I meant the last bit of practice. If I didn't say the last bit of qualifying, well... 
Well then, now you are doubly sure that this is practice. So yeah, race today. When, when I always do like an hour or or a, or a bit more of practice before the race. Just I need it, especially around this track. This is a very difficult track, and I really desperately need the, the, the any practice. Oh, I'm out of fuel. I forgot. Right, uh, Svin Kunas is actually quite close to me. Eh, no, he, wait, no, he's not. He's over. Why do I think he was close to me? He's well over a second behind. Okay, that's that's much better, actually. <laughs> no, Svin Kunas. Uh, yeah. Svin Kunas, he is the person behind me in the championship right now, so. Um, no, I, I want to make sure I don't lose a sp that I don't lose a spot to him. Okay, I'm gonna do uh, some high fuel running at the, for the end. So this is my race setup. Okay. Okay, when the race starts, remind me to set my brake balance to 57, not 58. 58 is not that good. I'm actually within a second of the cure of the current top time, but Danny is about to set up better lap time, I think. Danny, he's really intent on getting as many points as he can today. So uh He's been putting in the time and he's been really zooming. He's been fast. Like... Shit, like, Johan... Johan is closer to me than he is to Danny, which is... Insane, because Johan is one of the fastest guys in the league. It's like, you know, there's, there's two, the two real fast guys, right? There's Johan and there's Victor. And right now, I'm at... I'm like a tenth of Johan right now. And Johan is like... A, a, something... That means that Johan is like... Well over, it's over a second behind Danny. Which is nuts, because Danny, he, he's fast. Don't get me wrong, he is definitely... I mean, he's he's fighting for top three in the championship, right? But throughout the season, he's not quite been as fast as Victor and Johan. Which, you know, why he's behind both of them in the championship. I, but like, I'm, I just want to illustrate just, just how much that guy pulled out all stops. How much he wants to win this. So, and he's gonna be really upset if anybody ruins it for him. So, I better make sure it's not me. It... Yeah, there we go. Just shows up immediately. Second best lap, lap time on the server right now. Oh, oh okay, actually, okay, okay. So, never mind. So, everything I just said about Johan, never mind. He just he just set out an actual Johan type lap time. Which I'm okay with. I'm completely okay with being a second of Johan, honestly. This is like where I normally live. Uh, uh, even when at my fastest. But, you see, Johan is still, even, uh, even now, he is not matching Danny's best. Now the question is, can Danny you know, put in the lap times when it matters, right? Can he, you know, can can he get that? Can can he get pole position in qualifying? Can he keep it on track and ahead of of his rivals in the race? That's the question. That's a million dollar question, or in this case. That's the t-shirt question, because if he gets if he gets third in the championship, he gets a t-shirt. Like there's prizes in this thing. <laughs> there's actually prizes in this thing. And uh, and uh, let me tell you, Danny really wants that t-shirt. I would have wanted that t-shirt too if I was in his place. To be honest, I would have won that thing everywhere. I'm like, yeah, I won this in the championship. I'm cool. Can I sit with the cool kids now? <laughs> this. Oh. All right. 
this I know I've been I've not been streaming much besides racing, but that's because my schedule is a bit is a bit annoying right now. I got my Spanish classes now on Monday and and Wednesday, and like they're in a fairly awkward spot for me to be able to stream. Like I can't really stream before, because then I'll be too tired to do the Spanish class, and I can't really stream after because there isn't too much time before I have to go to sleep. And like I'm also quite tired after them. And like I can't really rearrange those I, like I can with my other things. Yeah. We might get some you might get some some more consistent Thursday streams for the next couple of weeks. My Thursday did get freed up. I want to get a um, uh, uh, more, more more high fuel running just because I've, I've not done as much of that as I should have really. People are leaving the server because it's gonna it's gonna restart soon for the rate for the race event. Kept it on track. Snacks racing. Who the fuck are you? Is, I, I, I do think there's a couple new people signed up for this final race, which is actually super scary. I think I smell cigarette smoke. Some motherfucker is smoking outside right be, right under my window. Or maybe like on the balcony or something. <clears throat> Mate. Okay, so okay, I'm gonna quit the server now. Uh, we're gonna wait for the server to restart. For we're gonna wait for the actual race event. Uh, is anybody? Uh, mm. I'm gonna ask if anybody wants to join voice, just cause like, just for some extra bit of fun. everybody mm. 
Remember the body, to finish first, you first have to finish. Honestly, that's actually such an amazing quote. That's one of my favorite racing quotes of all time. May might be my might be the favorite. Just because it's true and it's such a nice way of putting it, you know? Okay, server is live. The uh, the race session. So we are now going into uh, 15 minutes of practice, 10 minutes of qualifying, and two, one, two, 20 minute races for a total of 40 minutes of absolute carnage here at Sonoma. Absolutely amazing classic American race track. Honestly, great track. I love this place. Ca absolutely terrifying. Like, you know. I love Cadwell Park too, but that the racing there would be even more insane than it is here, you know. On, we'd have more luck at the bloody at the bloody Bathurst circuit at Mount fucking Panorama. We'd have more luck at the bloody Nordschleife, honestly, because Nordschleife a lot of its difficulty really comes from length. It's not, but. There are, aren't too many turns in the notch life that are as evil as some turns around here. But then you got, yeah, trucks. <laughs> Yeah, and then you got trucks like Cadwell Park, which just feels like a looped rally stage. I raced there once. It was it's a brilliant truck to drive, but it's also like it's a it's a murder truck. It, it's a truck that actively wants to kill those who dare those who dare put rubber upon its asphalt. And I love it for that. It's. And this truck, it's not, it doesn't strike me like it, like it wo straight up wants to kill you. I mean, maybe the curbs do, but the truck itself, it's, yeah, more, more than that, it does its thing that it doesn't care if anybody dies. Oh, Habiba will probably join voice. He does, he tends to do that, unless he's here as commentator. Oh, I think he's here as commentator, isn't he? I think, Hab oh, in that case, definitely check out the main commentator, because, again, <laughs> I'm not. I'm trying not to diss the main uh, commentator for the series because he's pretty good at his job. I, uh, he's, but it, I think two commentators are almost always better than one. And Habibo is also pretty damn good at his job. And Habibo with Mateusz, I, I believe they did co commentate before, so I, th I, I do think he's co commentating this one. I have to double check. Okay, that's okay. Okay, yeah, yeah, we're also doing high fuel runs and fuel does that matters quite a bit around here. But not quite as much as it possible. Uh, uh, yeah. I I think okay, I just wasn't used that out when I, uh, approaching that with such high speed, so I made a mistake. And took a bad line. I think I think I'm just generally a bit slow through that last section of the airs. I'm just a bit scared. So keep going. Yep.
I am actually zooming right now. Not, not as much as some others, but by my standards, I'm zooming. Oh yeah. Now there's some easy time save just from not making mistakes in in this sector. Uh, had to be a bit careful there, but I didn't lose too much time. Oh, okay. Yeah, fuel definitely, fuel definitely matters around that turn. Yeah, and like it also, and the dirt on the on the tires makes you lock your brakes. Yeah, that is actually I think you can get your tires dirty in a set. Oh. There's already some drama in chat. Hey, underling. No one did. <laughs> Indeed. I mean, well, rally drivers do. But, you know, some places there isn't, there isn't a way not to get the rubber dirty. I mean, rally, service, rally drivers are basically off-road aficionados, just faster. I mean, yeah, there's people like, you know, who like shit like rock crawling, which is... Which is not... Isn't simple off-road, but rock crawling is... Rock crawling is pretty mental, actually. Yeah. Yeah, rock crawling is fucking terrifying. Much more so than regular off roading, because. You know, I would like it until I fall off and die. Is, is, is That's how it would go, I think. Yeah, regular off roading, right? Like, uh, if, you, uh, if you're not going anywhere too insane, like, the worst you, that's gonna happen is you're gonna get your car stuck and you have to spend some some time or some cash getting it out. Which, you know, isn't great, but it's not... But, you know, it, there's no risk of death. Only risk to, to the wallet. And... That's much pref more preferable. Yeah, the thing is, no, I don't actually, I don't actually remember ever like, actually getting stuck off road, uh, except for when the car just straight up broke down. Like, there was one time where I think it was uh, the front drive shaft that failed on uh, on my grand. Well, it was it's now my mother's car. It was my grandmother's car at the time. Yeah, I think the fr it, it and it's an all all wheel drive Niva. The front dri drive shaft failed on that, I think, and we got stuck in the middle of a field surrounded by cows. The cows were very interested in us. So yeah, I had to wait for a while for you know for a, for a truck to arrive and get the car out of there. Spent quite a few, a decent amount of cash on that, I imagine. I was like, how old was I? Not very old. So I... But yeah. And that car... That car has been sitting... Ah, uh, shit sitting in a garage unused for years at that point so some of that failure is probably just due to all the age and gcus a lot of that yeah you 
You know, you know, one of our plans for actually getting the fuck out of Russia was to sell that car and buy an old, an old USV van and simply, <laughs> and simply drive drive the fuck away. Would have been funny. Would have been funny. Is, um, is Habiba sitting in your lap times? So I just want to see if he's actually, you know, racing or if he's commentating today. Because if he's racing, I might join him in voice chat. If he's commentating, then, well, I won't be able to do that because he'll be commentating. I also need to configure my charge out command properly because it's a bit, it's, a, it's very basic at the moment. Because I do want to give a shout out to the commentated broadcast. So y'all can at least look over there, they deserve the viewers. Okay, turn around. Oh, my neck. Oh, my neck again, help me. Turn left and okay, not great, but still faster than my pre previous personal best. My previous personal best kind of sucks in that place. Oh, yeah, that's a preview of what's gonna happen in the race, I think. Okay, no, Mateusz is alone. Helen Habibo is not is not chatting. Okay. So yeah, do go check them out. Uh, let me check if that's actually the correct link. I think it is. Lead Paul Racing. Yeah, yeah, that's correct. That's him. That's them. Yeah, say hi. Tell him I'm not sent ya. Yeah. Tell him you hope he do I don't crash out. Because I'm sure you hope I don't crash out. It'd be really unkind of you to hope that I do. Okay, I'll be back in a second. I will not be driving out until qualifying time. I walk alone the narrow streets of cobblestone Neath the halo of a street Okay, I'm going to kill the browser for the race Just for, just to uh, grab me Get myself an, uh, an extra frame per second or two I'm expecting 15, No more than 15 laps yeah, no way there's gonna be more than 15. Uh, uh, pretty much, yeah, yeah, no way, no way. 
Oh, yikes. Uh, this is... Uh, hold up. I'm just uh, trying to get my fucking... Oh, this will help, I think. No, maybe. Uh, hello. Okay, this should help. This should keep the cable pinned in place a bit better. And I can move my, my table a bit. Table, desk, whatever. Same fucking warden wash, you know. Don't you know? So yeah, so yeah, something I could actually do is uh, a bit silly. There's a bit of stuff, a silly way that I can do my song requests if I wanted to. Is I uh, is I can play in through my phone and uh, connect the, connect the phone in like pipe the phone into the into my sound interface, into my audio interface, and just uh, it'll be in mono because uh, the input on the audio inf interface is only mono, but it'll work and uh, it'll put zero, zero extra strain on my system, which is quite important when I'm, when this is my system, when the lap, when I'm on a bloody laptop. So I might, tr and so, you know, I might try doing that. And it also unrestricted me from when I could use uh, my, my sound, my, my, you know, my song, song requests. The, again, it doesn't matter if I'm in the race or what. I mean, in the race, I'd still not use it just for for concentration's sake. But it's not gonna, no longer gonna be performance for based and uh, and there's uh, like the, you know, just unlock some some other things I could do with it probably as well. It'll be easier for me to like. Uh, the, the only question is, I have no idea if uh, if a nightbot can actually, you know, do that. So I might have to use some other tool for that, or you know, some tool probably has a way of playing music f on my phone. And you know, if I can probably even get a stereo audio in some way, if the way to do that, I think would be. Well, there's probably some like there is, you know, quite good network audio support on Linux, with the help of, you know, with Pipewire and and even like even Pulse Audio Jack, like they all have network audio support. I th I think the way I, I I mean I think the way it works with Pipewire, they just use Pulse Audio's things because uh, it's ba it's backwards compatible. Pipewire, Pipewire is such a beautiful piece of software. I love it so much. It does like it's great. It just it just, it just works. So I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna do um, four laps. Is gonna be what four minutes? <coughs> okay. <coughs> okay. I'm gonna do a four lap run to start with, and then see how it goes. I will not be able to be one of the first people on track just because of how incredibly long the pit lane is around here so and i'm not gonna use the shortcut i think it might be illegal i have not clarified it so so I, it's better to err on the side of caution there lots of people leaving we might actually be f we might have few enough people that we will not get full points for the race because some people they might just be rejoining but i feel <laughs> illegal racing nah, this ain't need for speed my guy the same need for speed. I, I am afraid that some people might be leaving just because they no no Liam is just rejoining. Okay, I was genuinely worried about people leaving just because the, the pace difference around here is just massive. We have people like four seconds of pace. Okay, I'm going to wait. I'm gonna st st stay here and wait. Look at the look at the track map, and I'm just gonna wait until there's a big free spot for me to go into. I think that that oh shit! <laughs> I did oh man I didn't even I didn't even have time to leave the pit lane before having my first incident. Oh that's hilarious. At least I won't get penalized for that. Since you know, it's just a skill issue that didn't affect anybody else in any way, shape, or form, and it's not even against the rules to do what I just did. So you know, it's just really really funny that first thing I do in practice session is just crash right away. Oh, this is, I got so much free space. Okay, just... I'm actually gonna go quite slow on this outlap, just so I can increase the amount of free space ahead. 
Yeah, I think I've timed this quite well. Now, people will crash up ahead and the field will stretch. But... Still... Yeah, just, uh, just gonna keep it slow. There's nobody around me, I'm gonna make good use of that. Uh, behind me is John. Right now, yeah, John's close behind me. He's, n he's not gonna be as fast as me. Like, I know his pace, he's not that... Like, I'm gonna be faster. I, I like I really dislike saying that all like like oh this guy's gonna be slower than me or I'm gonna be faster than this guy because like even though it's true it just feels like it just feels so disrespectful you know okay I'm in a, a, this I think this is a very good amount of free air I'm in now so uh, let's get in there okay okay got to be zooming yeah look at that. We thought, so see, that's uh, the line I can't quite take on race fuel because the car is just a bit too heavy for that to work. So I think in race I'm actually going to keep fifth gear through there. Just because it's it's quite a bit slower, but it's also massively safer. Okay, um, a lot of free space ahead of me just disappeared, but the guy ahead of me is faster than me, which means I really shouldn't be able to catch him. Like, not unless he makes a big mistake, in which case I'm, I just hope he stays off the racing line. And, you know, I know, but nobody's immune from skill issues, not even the fastest guys. Some people just have a greater resistance. But never outright immunity. If you have skill, you can have a you can have an issue with it. Oh yeah, I can keep so much more speed there on low fuel, that's amazing actually. Okay, that's actually a good, uh, that's good lap by my standard. 32, you know, 32.5 30 will, uh, it, it'll, it'll give me a good position for the start, whatever happens. This is a fantastic bunker lap. There's a couple tenths I can save here and there still though. And I'm gonna try that in the next two laps. Oh yeah, like that. Low fuel is so helpful here. Like it's mental. Okay, nothing fancy there, I know. Yeah, not, yeah, keep it simple from now on. If you just get a low 32, that'll be very good for you. Oh! No, that's... Yeah, I lost some time, not too much, though. Yeah, I wasn't as fast as I could have been through there last time, so... Oh, yeah, I'm zooming. Uh, tires are a bit, gonna get a bit dirty, but I think it's... Oh, yeah, it's fine. Oh, yeah, that's gonna be a really low 32. That's... I'm so, I'm super happy with that time, actually. What the fuck? I'm not choking in quality. That's a 32-0. That's my PB. Do you know how long... Do you, I don't think I've ever set a new PB in quality before. Like, in my entire life. lost some time I don't think I lost too much yeah I can regain that
Yeah, there we go, there we go, there we go. Uh, I don't think that's going to be an improvement. I, I don't... Oh yeah, that's that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. Okay. I have time, I think, for an outlap and a lap, that's it. Yeah, just one outlap. One more. Okay, so a few laps for two laps only. And go, go, go. I don't have time to wait for a, a, a window. Okay, who's ahead? Is that, is that Habibo? Habibo, go away! No, that's John. John, go away! Okay. We're gonna be in, okay. That's a good. That's a, that's as good a place and exit as we could as I could get. I no longer have the luxury of choice. Mm. Yeah, I'm. I'm gonna try and make some space to John, but I don't know if I'll if it'll succeed because I do. Ooh, yeah, big big crash. Uh, I'll, I think I'll try and get ahead of John. Mm, maybe not. We're both on an outlap. I'll, I'll flash my lights at him so to tell him that I'd like to be let through. Just once. Like, let him know I'm there. Thank you, John. Thank you so much, my man. That was very kind of him. Like, he had no obligation to do that. Like, uh, uh, like he, that was just, that was just a, a very polite moment by him. Okay. This is the final lap of Quali. This, I think I can do a 31, but... That's as good as... I actually don't think I can improve my position. I can improve my lap time, but... I, ah, no, no, no. I can. I think I can go ahead of Gramage. I think I can go ahead of Juan. <gasps> did not... Did, did not... Did not invalidate somehow. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna be improving on this lap time. Well, I really don't think so. Ah, uh, maybe. There's two, two tenths to recover. It's possible, but I'm not gonna improve enough. Yeah, no way now. Oh, well, I'm, I'm super happy with this qualifying performance, honestly. This is the first time in forever that I had a PB in quality. Usually my PB comes in the race. Or, or, or in practice if I'm if I'm unlucky. Hey, yep, that's that. Cut detect lap will not count. Okay, I'm, I will simply go into pits and just Just gonna thank John for letting me through. It didn't end up like it. It was incredibly polite of him, and he deserves a thanks. I'm gonna put 26 years of you because I'm, I'm paranoid a bit. That the calculation is slightly off, but there's no way it's gonna be more than 15 laps. Ugh. Okay. <laughs> Fuck traffic. I mean, yeah, understandable. I'm quite a few spots and and over a second ahead of Toutvidas. So 
Ooh, Habibo. But yeah, I'm like, I like I predicted, I'm in no man's land. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm several tenths. I'm four tenths behind Juan, and I'm a full second ahead of, ahead of Badem. Ahead of Habibo. Like, if, so I, if I can keep this kind of pace in the race, you know, not quality pace, but like this kind of difference to people around me, this should be a decently easy P6 as, as long as I just survive T1. The problem is that Habibo is behind me. Habibo has been known to make really good starts. He... So... Okay, just... I, I'm begging people to be careful because I do need to beg, beg them. Okay. Danny with the third Danny, like I said, he is he wants this he wants this win and he wants it bad. And uh, I honestly, I hope he gets it. I I really do. <laughs> Double P1, I think, is entirely possible for Danny with the pace he's displayed. But I don't know. The question is if it's possible with, the, with, his, with his consistency, because I do not have enough information on his consistency to make a judgment either way. But his pace... I mean, clearly the best. He's been the only one, I think he's still the only one to get into the 130s. So, yeah. Okay. I, am I ready? Okay, I'm gonna turn on the fan. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, that's nice. That's cold. Oh, that's real cold. But it's better to be cold than to be sweaty. Alright. Mm. Uh, Alright, everybody. We are on the grid for race one of two. This is gonna be... Gonna, gonna tell, tell them. Okay, we are on the starting grid. We, we are, we are ready to go as ready as we could possibly be. So yeah, I don't know maybe, go, maybe go to the main broadcast and put some Anno propaganda in chat if you feel like it. Sixteen, it's, it ain't gonna be sixteen point five laps, mate. What are you doing? Ah, sixteen point five laps is what you, you they get for that fuel in. Okay. It's gonna be less, it's gonna be 15 laps. <sighs> okay. Okay, let's do this. Okay, single file please, yes. Mm. Mm. 
Mate! Mmh. Ok. Ok, I've survived. No red flag! We are amazing! We are amazing! Yeah, we deserve a round of applause for that, I think. I think we are all amazing for pulling that off. All of us. Okay. Oh, Toadfield is behind me. <laughs> well, I better not let him catch up then. No, then. Oh yeah, they've had some issues. Now oh, there's Habibo. I should be quite a bit faster than him, but I'll be very careful on my, with my overtaking. Oh fuck, I touched the wall like a, like a silly boy. Like a silly boy! Oh, Habibo, why are you... What are you... Why are you going for it, my man? Habibo ha, has gone for a move that he shouldn't have. And that that gave me a, the position for first, essentially free in, in an overtake that really shouldn't... Fuck's sake! I'll, my, I might get a fucking penalty for that. Oh, I hate myself. S still, it's early in the race. There's time to left to recover, thankfully. Oh, my brake balance is wrong! Okay, I just need to be ahead of Taut Vidas. Uh, Habibo's gonna be so mad! Oh no, I'm so sorry, Habibo, man. Okay. Okay, simply be careful through this, stay close, make the move later. Ah, not not careful enough, I'm not. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna be making a move into two one, I'm not that silly. We can mm, oh, Fort up oh, Fort is crashed up ahead. Simply follow, make a move into one of the hairpins. No, there's no rush. Patience is a virtue. Very unfortunate that Miss that Habib had to hit me in. Um. He's driving smart. He's defending, but not overcommitting to the defense. But he's made a he's made a mistake. Unfortunately, the dirty air means that I lose out still. I will not be able to make an overtake into T1 because it's too risky. Yeah, kind of let him get away with that mistake, but it's he breaking. There's no breaking zone there. Come on, man. Mm. 
Yeah, we're stuck in a train right now. Nobody can overtake each other. But the, yeah, at least Habibu, at least Habibu got a better deal than me out of that collision. So I screwed myself more than I screwed him. So except for the penalty, which I'll probably get. Okay, I think that's not very good for Tautvidas. Mm, no, I will not be able to send it. I think he's breaking a bit early. But I, but there's, uh, but I'm never close enough to exploit it properly. Uh, it's so hard to follow through here as well, just with the dirty air and the fuel still being quite. Uh, there's still lots of. He's not taking very good lines. Like he's making mistakes, but I cannot capitalize. Somehow I avoided that. Cost me quite a bit of time. Not as much time as it cost Habibo. Habibo really wants the position back as well. Tautvitas being ahead is really annoying for me though. This guy is really slow. What the hell? He's breaking like so much when he shouldn't when 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 like he, way more than he has to. I'm having to break very early so I don't hit them all. Okay, follow my own line, just be careful, try to stay out of the jetty here as much as you can. Okay, full throttle now. Will not be able to catch him yet. Not but I Skill issue. Uh got a I I I really wanted that to be there as I got a bit over enthusiastic with the throttle. Habibo better not send it. It'll be a very silly if he does. There we go. Okay, I'm no longer in danger of in immediate danger of of ascent. Okay, can I get him oh, on the long left hander? No, it's it's way, uh, it's much harder to overtake around here than I anticipated. Like I'm just not close enough into any of the hairpins to do it. Mm. Like look how much I gain just on breaking because he's not he's breaking way too early. Both the drivers are head up. Oh yeah, that's much better this time. Finally, find them out of duty for a... Okay. No, I'm not close enough. Like, I'm in sleep stream, but it's not gonna matter. I'm, because I just wasn't close enough when I exited, so... And my acceleration wasn't better enough. Trying to just pressure him into a mistake mm -hmm. because it's because of how I don't know Juan's leading. Hope, uh, hope. Where's Danny? Uh, Danny has to still be in the top three. Mm. 
Jochen isn't. Like they break so early, it's straight up hazardous for me to follow. It's such a shame that I made that mistake. It's such a shame. Now finishing here will put me in an excellent position for race two, but I'd rather be also be in excellent position for race one. You know. Okay, I'm right on his arse now. Oh, and he's hit the wall and that's a posi position gain. I did not touch him at all, D didn't force him into that. He just made a mistake while trying to give me space. I've, and unfortunately I was just out of options to make a move at that point. Okay, na now on to Tautvidas. Mr. Svinkunas. The Lithuanian driver. I am going to catch him. And I'm going to overtake him. And, uh, and, and he's not going to catch me in the championship. I will simply not give him the chance. Just don't get too... Just don't get too aggressive. Again, be calm, be patient. Mm, shit. Get around him same way you did. Get around him just like you did with Mateusz. The tires are wearing, but the fuel is burning. Mm. Mm. I can deal with no grip. Well enough. I practiced it. Oh, Sarah! Sarah's gonna be. Sarah's in here. Cool. Yeah, and like the car being lighter will be very, very helpful around this track. bit wide but not enough to lose any time to Tautvidas just to my PB and PB doesn't matter only Tautvidas matters that sounds really romantic <laughs> only only Tautvidas losing matters ha come on oh I'll get ya oh I'll get ya my friend oh I'll get ya Now, with tire wear, I think we'll bring a few more incidents up ahead and and for sure we'll bring some incidents behind. Some people might be a bit more caught out b by the tire wear. Yeah, I consistently get about two tenths for him in that final turn, but he's just quite fast around the whole lap. Uh, slower than me, but quite fast. But oh, that was a mistake. Oh, that's a mistake. That I'm. I need. I will not be able to immediately overtake him after that, but. It, it, it might just bring enough of a time loss for, for him to for me to catch up. Yeah, I'm closer than, uh, than I have been in a while now. I think I got better acceleration here. I'm, I'm not sending it. I can't send it, I don't think. Okay, keep it close. Is, 
he does have to deal with dirty air, that helps, but... Oh, I'm de oh, I definitely have the move on it. But it's a good defense by him. That's a, that's a good racing. That's good racing. <laughs> I couldn't quite keep it around the outside. I'm, I'm losing grip. My, my, my rear tires are going. I don't know if he knows that he's fighting for his championship for his championship position, but but he should drives like he does. That, uh, that just happened to screw me over quite a bit more than it did him. That just bad luck by me, terrible luck. But still, P that's P7. That actually really bad for me, because like the higher you get, get, get the ha the more the po the points differences between uh, positions. Still, without being in the dirty air, I should be able to catch him. Or I could just, you know, do this. Silly, silly boy. What a silly boy, Anno. Uh, he cannot send it from this far back. No, unless he wants to crash. And, and like, people typically don't want to do that. Yeah, I'm really betting that mm, he will have issues with his tire wear at this point. Because I'm running out of time to... C I, I can catch. Overtaking is another matter entirely. I, this will put me ahead in race too. So, ooh, Victor Bernat is behind. Uh, well, he's, well, I guess... Well, I guess I know who's winning race two, barring some incidents. Which, you know, good chance of that. That was, that was quite risky to stay on the throttle there, but... I pulled it off just just about. But yeah, I might still have a penalty if not, if not, if not for the incident itself, then for the rejoin after it, because that was a bit of a silly rejoin. I got and you know I did cause a collision, even if it didn't cause anybody to be you know wiped out. <clears throat> uh, yeah, the fun was on the right call, by the way. Uh, he's sliding a bit. Ugh, come on, make a mistake. Just one mistake, I beg you, man. Taut vidas. It's a bit better on the exit of that happen. Only a bit, though. And I'm better through the SS, I think, but only a little bit. Oh, th that's it. So like he needs to crash right now, or I, or that's it, or I don't, I don't overtake him. Yeah, I cannot send it that from that far. Oh, 
Oh, that's so close! <laughs> I came so close, my man! Oh. oh, what good racing. Honestly, fantastic racing but without Vidas. Oh, shit. Race over. Yeah, that was a good, that was, I'm unhappy with losing the positions, but that was fantastic fucking racing. Okay, I'll be back. Okay, I'll be back in a second. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Right, I'm here. Let's go with gaming. That was great racing. People are being really salty, like I'm being... People are being really fucking salty in chat. Like, like here's me, uh, you know, apologizing for a mistake and, uh, you know, and, uh, you know, complimenting people on good racing, but people, j but people are getting fucking salty. Uh, a bit salty than they should. Okay, I'm gonna definitely go with 25 liters, even though I ended up with a lot of liters at the end. I don't know how many laps I was, I wasn't 15 laps. Oh, I thought, oh. No, nah, no, nah, I'm not gonna get any more water until the end of this, because I need it. Uh, maybe a little bit. Hold up. Hydration has been ha, 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 hydration has been achieved. I will not gonna report it because she's gonna get DSP from the league. Oh come on man. But, oh, but demon, oh, oh. Habibo on pole. He's on mediums. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, we are about to get sent to the grid, and I just told him to pull some softs. Okay, so Mateusz, I'm not worried about. 
Uh, don't be uh, some. Sim objective one is indeed simply to survive because uh, we somehow pulled off a very clean start the first time around i'm scared now people might get a bit confident now which is bad all right let's do it let's do this one last time in this league hopefully i don't want to restart Okay, I got involved in one little incident, but not too much. It might, uh, in any way, it's not gonna be a restart. Taut Vidas is behind me, that's, and that's where I want him to stay. Johan is ahead, I'm gonna try. Mm, uh, that's actually a whole group of fast guys, so my goal is to try and follow them through. As they cut their way through the field. Quite a bit of time loss there. I had to, I had to really slam on the on the brakes to not hit Johan there. Nice. I break break just a bit early just to make sure I'm clear of any chaos ahead. That's not a good line at all, actually, but it'll have to be good enough for now. No, n no red flags. Okay. Uh, okay. Anybody? To okay. Okay. That's amazing, actually. Anybody? You know? Fucking hell. Okay, that's P6. That's very nice for me. And that's put a couple cars between me. Oh, Gideon had, had a mis made a mistake. Or was it Johan? Doesn't matter. I can get in a good position from here. Podium possible. Not gra not anywhere near guaranteed, but quite possible. I just need to stay smart. Get Gideon ASAP, but not... Don't rush it, dog. Rushing it just leads to pain. Iker is gonna be catching, but not stupidly fast. Quite wide, unfortunately. Uh, Iker actually did not catch at all when I did that, though, so... Yeah, they're fighting. Uh, Habibo's fighting for his life and holding people up quite a bit by doing that. Mm. 
Oh yeah, but he will lose a position now. Unless... Oh, wow! Habibo! <laughs> but Habibo just fucking gift wrapped me a pair of positions. Oh, and they had a collision behind. That's so sad. Habibo just fucking gift wrapped two positions for me. That's amazing. Thank you, Habibo. Thank you so much, my man. Okay, Johan, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna make moves on you, I'm... Sorry, that's a bit of a, that's a bit of a touch. That was silly by me. No, Iker. I'm not letting you through. Johan did, you know, overtake me. I just didn't fight him very hard. You have to at least, you know, start overtaking me for me to start considering letting you through. No! Issue! Skill issue! Skill issue by Iker Maraver! Oh no! That's so depressing, man! Poor Iker. He had so much to live for, and now he's dead. Okay, I'm far enough to not really be affected by dirty air too much, so, which is good. Mm. Mm. Jochen, you're gonna have to go through or like, I'm gonna have to send it on you. Uh, Iker, Johan. Do I call him your, your, your Iker? No, no, no. I, it's in my best interest to let him overtake Habibo, really. But he's simply not doing that. And that's the thing, right? He doesn't have the best pace around here, but he's a fantastic wheel to wheel racer. But apparently not quite... Uh, he might still... No, no, he's, he's gone. He's gone. He put, a hell of a put up a hell of a defense, though. Unfortunately, he's gonna lose another position soon enough. No matter how much I can appreciate that defense, I want them points, Habibo! Mr. Habibovic! I'm being a bit silly, making some mistakes right now. I need to stop. No, I'll like stop the car, but stop making mistakes. Okay, be patient. Podium is not realistic at this point, unless somebody has a skill issue, so... But before, entirely possible. Habibo can defend well, but... I, I think I'll find my way around eventually. Yeah, like I can obey him pretty easily into that hairpin if uh, if I'm close enough. I just need to be close enough.
Mm. Nope. I got the speed, Habibo. Okay, fair. Right. Uh, some, uh, some touching there, but no hard feelings, I hope. Oh, there, uh, that's it, that's it. There he goes. He made it. There he goes. Never mind, I didn't outbreak him by as much as I needed to. Oh, now I got Tikker on my arse as well. Irritating. Okay, that's forced Iker to back off quite a bit, that's good. Gives me some more time to attack Habibo. I'm sliding around a bit, I think my tires are a bit more gone than they were last time at this point in the race. Looks like Mateusz behind is putting up quite a fi fight against Ticker as well, which is perfect for me. He, yeah, but Habibo really struggles around this turn. That's my, that's really my prime overtaking opportunity. Maybe next lap. But uh, you know, honestly, I think this proves my fear theory. People are so scared of this truck that they respect it and they, they become extra careful. And that's why there hasn't been too much carnage. There's been quite a bit of attrition, yes, but... No massive pileups or anything silly like that. He's driving a bit defensively, but I'm not gonna go for a move here. It's a bit. S I just need to stick close until a better opportunity presents itself. And I have to drive. Yeah, I have to drive, be very oppor opportunistic to get overtakes around here. And this is my next chance. I need him to make. I need him just to. No, him to make a mistake. Ah, but he did anyway. There it is. Mm, well, he couldn't quite keep it on track. <laughs> almost like he tried... Well, obviously not intentional. But, like, it's almost like he nearly did to me what I did to him in race one. Mm. Okay. I, I, unfortunately, this does mean that... Mm, this does mean that he is no longer keeping the people who are behind me well behind with his defense. Shame about the way that I ended up. Real shame. <laughs> mm. 
And now I've got Juan behind me and Iker is somewhere there. I don't know if Iker will, will make it. Will make it through in time, but Juan's right there. But I need just to relax and just drive casually. <laughs> Tires aren't too worn yet. Oh, finally got this not terribly wrong. Yeah, but not ha not being stuck behind a slow behind another driver is uh, really helping my pace. There's no doubt here to deal with. No, I can actually you know break out my preferred breaking points instead of a bit earlier, so I'm so I'm so I'm sure I don't crash. Yeah, like that. I break. I I don't think I ever managed could ever could break that late when racing somebody through there. It's just too risky. Unless you're side by side and I never managed that. No, I did manage that once, but I still break a bit earlier because I was a bit scared. It's a scary track, isn't it? He, uh, Juan gains a lot of time in the S's. Which is entirely unsurprising. But he loses time elsewhere, so it's not... Too, yeah, he's only gained two-tenths uh, over this lap, so that's okay. And I'm kind of zooming, let's be real. I mean, I'm not going to be pulling out any quality laps, but my, but my quality lap was pretty okay, so... And we, and we, we both got Taiwei to contend with at this point in the race. He's not one of the people on medium, but but actually I think medium still walk, still do well. They just wear a bit. Like I mean, obviously they still wear, but they still wear enough to be a problem, because Tautidas obviously struggled with Taiwei in race one, even though he was on mediums. But it felt like I had the advantage, even though it shouldn't have felt that way. I guess my advantage is that I got more practice with driving on one on one rubber. Yeah. Okay. That's good. That's good. I did. I didn't lose. I did not lose time to him this time. Fuck's sake, man! Mm, that's time loss. That's big time loss, unfortunately. Uh, thankfully, no suspension damage, sir. Still, it's qu still defending on this track, as Habibu has proved, is very much possible. Ooh, that's a bad line. Decent enough acceleration, though. Маячит сволочь в стекле, в, блин, в зеркале. Well, only a couple laps left now, though. And, he's, and he'll have dirty air to contend with now. Big lockup, unfortunately. Not. Uh, I uh, will see if he can. If he can. Obviously, he's a good driver. I'm not expecting him to crash from dirt air, but he is a human and will be slowed down. I had to back off a bit. Bad line. Bit of a wobble, but I didn't lose any time to him. I think this has to be the last lap now. Mm. 
lost a bit of time, not much. Mm, it's a bit, he's not gonna overtake through here anyway. It's just too silly to go for that move. Mm, he's getting me on the braking, he has more confidence. Oh, my fucking fan has been off the whole race, that's why... I, uh, He'll have a sleep stream, but he does not have uh, an acceleration advantage, so... The, why are you hitting me again, you fuck? Oh, now we kiss ahead, fuck's sake! I'm reporting that just in case, like... First... First bit of contact... My fault. I am uh... I'm, I'm gonna report that there. First bit of contact, my fault. Second bit of contact, uh, questionable. Oh, I, I, why did I break that much? Oh, Ikas letting me through. That's so nice of him. Oh, they've both let me through. Okay, I'm not reporting that then. Like, didn't have to do that. P4, they raced... Uh, yeah, uh, very nice of him to let me through, but even though not necessary. Uh, that was fantastic racing. Yep, we're gonna, that's it, we're gonna finish up here. Uh, some people are not as happy as me, but that's okay. Yeah, I'll, I'm gonna send you all over to the... Uh, you know, we're gonna do the usual thing and send you all over to the main broadcast. Well, I'll be doing an interview, because they interview anybody who, who asks for it. So, you know, and I always ask for it, because I, I got to have that attention! But yeah, everybody, we're gonna send you... P4, almost a podium, not quite. I'm gonna send you all over mm, to, but yeah, I'm gonna send you all over to the main broadcast now. So everyone, thank you for, thank you for being here, thank you for watching the race, and uh, but yeah, everybody, once again. Thank you very much. Uh, and have a good one. And see you all next time. But for now, go go on and uh, spam some unknown propaganda in that poor racing chat. See you later and bye bye. <laughs>